Why are we successful? Why are we motivated? Why do we do what we do? These are the questions that we asked ourselves to determine our core values. The values that make us who we are and drive us to success. Being professional, your integrity, your positivity, all of those affect everyone around you and all of your clients. Every day you want to continuously improve, so to have those core values pinned down is, I think, really important. I think five words that we've got are really appropriate. Anyone can relate to it. You really do suit Hazel's. These qualities define us both at work and in all that we do. So what is it that drives us? Is it being approachable? We are all outgoing and adventurous and I think that works well, helps us with our work to create a good atmosphere. I think that we're all approachable, we're all chatty, outgoing people. I would like to think that the first thing we do when we meet a new client is invest some time, get to know that client and build that relationship up. So as soon as we possibly can, we are forging brilliant relationships just to facilitate a good, open dialogue. Is it our honesty? Ultimately, somebody has to decide who is in that side. That is me. They expect honesty from me. If I wasn't honest, they would see through me. I expect honesty from them in return. If I don't get it, they won't last long. And I think honesty is really important. If you're not being honest about what's happening, then it's difficult to build a relationship on that. We can't do our work if our clients don't trust us, if they're not totally honest and open with us. There's no way they will be honest and open with us if we are not honest and open with them. Is it being supportive? With a horse, you have to work as a team. You have to trust each other. You have to be able to rely on each other and understand each other, which when you're dealing with people every day, you have to then bring those skills in again just to understand other people's needs. Our coach is really good. He's good at encouraging us all and, and getting the best from us. It's just great to encourage everybody else to do well and if they've done a good shot or a good great serve, just to sort of acknowledge that. I've been with Hazelwood about a year and a quarter. My manager has really helped me you know, sort of settle in and, and help me to sort of know my, my own job and, and the work that I need to do. How about innovative? Innovation in aero design, it's, it's a lot more about um, being aerodynamic rather than lighter, the stiffness and flex in, in frame technology. You've got to use all the, the best, and Hazelwoods do invest you know, heavily in their IT environment, so I want to be able to pass that investment in and downwards onto the, the end user, give them a good experience. So everybody is constantly evaluating, is this the best way of doing it? And, and I think every single day people are questioning how and why they do things. Could it be excellence in all that we do? We're all perfectionists. There are very high standards that are set. We all want to do things as well as we can. Excellence is important because without that, Hazelwoods wouldn't have clients, they wouldn't gain new clients, they wouldn't maintain their old clients, therefore we wouldn't be here. And Hazelwoods does have an excellent reputation. There are some sophisticated, process-driven methods of working which enable us to reach as high standards as we possibly can. Honesty, supportiveness, excellence, approachability and being innovative. These are the values that make us who we are. The values at the core of our existence. The values that drive us as individuals and as an organisation to be the very best in all that we do. This is why we are successful. This is Hazelwoods.